Welcome back. Polling places are still open in Arizona as Republican and Democratic residents cast their votes in the 2016 presidential race. One America's Greta Wall is live in Phoenix. Greta, I know you are at a polling place there in Phoenix, Arizona, that is. What's the turnout like? Yeah, yeah, we're here at the Salvation Army in downtown Phoenix, and the turnout's great. The, you know, the line starts inside behind me, but it goes all the way around the corner and down the block. So there's tons of voters here. Now, remember, there's 58 delegates on the line for the GOP, 85 for the Democrats. It's a bigger race for the GOP. It's a winner-take-all. This is the biggest winner-take-all left in the Republican race. So this is a big race for those guys. Now, Donald Trump was heavily favored going into this race with an average of about 13 points of a lead. So the latest Real Clear Politics average polls showed Trump with 34% of voter support here in Arizona, 21% of voter support for Cruz, and just 12.5% for Kasich. Now, something that helped Trump here in Arizona was definitely the endorsement of Maricopa County Sheriff Joe Arpaio. Now, he officially endorsed Trump on January 26th, and I spoke with him earlier this afternoon. Here's what he had to say about why Trump is the best pick for the GOP. Let's put it this way, personalities again. There are winners and there's losers in your life. He's been a winner in his life. Do you think he's going to lose just over a general election versus Hillary? Come on. It's not in the cards. Not in the cards. In fact, they all, all the Republicans, just, he can never beat Hillary. He could never be Hillary. They're saying that because they don't want him to be president. Not that he can't beat him. That's a game they're playing. Oh, he'll never win the general election. That's why we don't want him. It'll be a disaster. He's the only one that can be Hillary. Now, uh, Arpaio also criticized officials in the GOP for being so anti-Trump, saying that he should be the one that they're uniting around, that the UNC should be uniting around this candidate because he is the only one that could beat Hillary Clinton in the general election. Back to you, Mike. Greta Wall, I know you sat down with uh, Sheriff Arpaio. You had about a half-hour interview with the sheriff. What other, uh, what other issues are pushing Sheriff Arpaio to support Donald Trump? Yeah, you know, everyone focuses on illegal immigration. They say Arpaio likes Trump because of illegal immigration. Trump's strong on illegal immigration. And of course, yeah, that pushes Arpaio to like him. But it's not just that. It's all really more his policy on the drugs coming across the border. So Arpaio, he worked, he spent over 20 years with the DEA. He's really strong about drugs coming across the border. And he feels like Trump is the only candidate who is noticing or talking about that there's a problem with the, with drugs coming across the border and he's really passionate about that and he's happy to hear Trump actually mentioning that and talking about that and saying that his wall is going to stop that when he builds it if he becomes president. One America's Greta Wall keeping a very close eye on Arizona. We will be checking back in with Greta Wall throughout the evening live in Phoenix, Arizona. Thanks Greta.